Hi, I'm Paul Elio, CEO of Elio Motors, and today I'd like to talk to you about our new vehicle. As you can see, it's got three wheels. It's front engine, front wheel drive, so it's two people front to back. The reason for that is at highway speeds, most of your fuel goes to moving air. So by being half as wide, we move half as much air, we get double the mileage. Our targets are a 84 miles per gallon highway, $6,800 sticker price, built in Shreveport, Louisiana with 90% North American content. Another part of the reason why we can hit the sticker price and price point is we committed to building our own engine. It was developed for us by IV. IV does all of the engine development for Mercedes-Benz and BMW, among others. This is the first time a new American startup showed a vehicle with its own engine in it since Nash did it in 1951. So it's been about 65 years. This is not a trivial mile milestone. Other things that I find compelling about the vehicle is the fact that we're going to change how vehicles are dis distributed with our E Plus system. So with E Plus, we only build our vehicles two ways, standard or automatic, that's it. They all come with uh, air conditioning, power window, power door lock, and a stereo, because pretty much everybody wants that. All the rest of the upscale content you're used to getting, you can get on your Elio, but we add it post-manufacture. Right? If you want blind spot detecting mirrors or a leather seat, you can get that on your Elio, but we add it after we made the car. So you get a lot more of what you want for a lot less. The other impacts that it has for the customer is because this stuff is not integrated, you can upgrade over time. Think about how many vehicles are out there with a cassette player integrated in the dash, just taking up space and, and adding weight, right? So as technology changes, you can swap things out. Another big consequence of this system is most of the content in the vehicle is created by the auto parts suppliers. And these big suppliers have a hard time getting their products on other vehicles because everybody wants to be second, nobody wants to be first, because if it doesn't work, you want it to be on the other guy's brand. Because we designed this to be added after we make it, make it, it's easy to take back off. So if something doesn't work, we'll have a liberal return policy and we'll pull it back off for you. So we, we can allow a lot more content options to you, the customer. Also, the big guys have to decide for you. If there's two competing platforms, they decide which one that is gonna be integrated in their vehicle. So you may like their vehicle better, but the other platform better, and you can't get that. At Elio, we will, we're a retailer. We're going to have Heinz and Hunt's ketchup, right? So you get to select the one that makes most sense for you. Um, and then the, lastly, you get technology first. Even if the other guys get enamored with it, because of the design type cycle, it takes three or four years before you see it. So the, for the first time ever, the lowest priced vehicle in the market is going to have the best technology first. For more information, go to eliomotors.com, E-L-I-O motors.com. How long do we have to the next one? Cue up the uh, front of the car so they can get the... Oh, you can do, take it from the other. Never do, mind. Do we have enough time for a smoke break between now and the next one? For, uh, let's see. When's the next radio? How close are we to the next radio? Uh, or next TV? Oh, uh, that's not enough. 10.45, 11.45. What do you got? Oh, 11.45, that's seven minutes. Yeah, you want to run? Yeah. I, I, All right, do it. I, I,